It's been almost two weeks since we announced Isekai Inc., and we've been bombarded with questions from both Twitter and the Isekai Inc. Discord server. We've gotten a lot of good stuff from everyone, and I'm so thankful you're all so interested in Generation 1. Since we started, it's been about six months to the day since we released our original Gen 1 video, so why don't we do a little refresher for all our new interns? We'll talk about what we're looking for in a potential Isekai Inc. Gen 1 talent, as well as the nitty gritty of how we as an actual VTubing agency will support them. There are a lot of VTubers. Like, a lot. And unfortunately, that saturation comes with the challenge of visibility. Now, I know there's tons, probably hundreds of potential future isekai protagonists that aren't being noticed due to the sheer lack of visibility within these platforms. However, we aim to make Isekai Inc. that platform that will bring visibility to our stars. Now, having said that, though, there's a couple of requirements we'd want our freshly departed to have before we decide to send them to that big truck in the sky. Now, firstly, you've got to be over 18. This is especially important as we've decided that if a talent wishes to use OnlyFans or a certain mm -mm site for additional adult-oriented content, we'll allow it. And uh, you'll need to be streaming at least three times a week. And if you're not, that's going to need to change, or you'll need to be pumping out additional content to supplement your streams. You'll need to be able to work with your future generation as a team. It's important to us that we create a work environment where you're excited and enthusiastic to be a part of a fully independent VTuber company. And this goes without saying, but part of being an enthusiastic employee is that you'll need to be passionate about streaming. I don't care if you're a guy who spends 17 hours playing a terrible game from 2001 while forcing tons of VTubers and friends to play with you in a single sitting to beat the world speed record for a four-player online co-op game, or if you just like to have the red button on OBS blinking while you stream to zero people. We need our idols to love streaming. Finally, you need to speak English fluently. It doesn't need to be your native tongue. You don't even have to stream in English all the time, but you do need to be fluent. So that's what it takes as far as being a streamer, but what about some of the assets that aren't exactly necessary, but will greatly increase your chances of getting hired? Well, uh, singing or artistry will help. I don't care if you make plushies on stream, sing a song or even basket weave. If you're good and you can make it entertaining, uh, it's good. Uh, humor. Not everyone is as funny as me. Uh, I know. But... <laughs> but, uh, it's a great, <laughs> great boon to be funny. Uh, you don't have to be the next stand-up comedian or whatever, but being able to laugh and make jokes, even when the going gets tough on stream, is a valuable skill. Now, if you're comfortable with OBS, you know your way through the program, uh, I personally will find that incredibly valuable. The less work I have to do fixing your guys' streams, the better it is for me. If you have streamed before, that's a plus. We won't be looking at this part too harshly, as a lot of very good streamers are people who haven't done it for very long, but it's always a plus if you have some prior knowledge. Good internet connection. Seriously, can't stream on 3G? Gotta get those tasty 5G braids in your thinking, bro. Finally, these are some things that don't really matter, like at all. Uh, how big your existing audience is right now doesn't really matter to us. Like I said, visibility is the number one problem for VTubers. Your gender, we're aiming for talent, not tits. Uh, and finally, your location. Isekai Worldwide, baby! The last one is kind of a big one. Your existing model. Now, we've talked about how with Isekai Inc., we were originally going to rebrand you, but allow you to keep your existing audience and make your new model a part of who you are. We had some feedback and have decided to roll back on making that mandatory and are open to adapt your existing design to fit the image of Isekai Inc. And if you don't have a model, or if you want to rebrand, you'll have input on how we craft your new VTuber persona. We're not going to lock you into a cat mascot suit with the head that won't unzip if you don't want to be in one. 
To add on to what Booster said, this doesn't mean you should DM us what you want your new persona to be, even before getting hired. You don't go into a job interview with a list of things you want out of the job before even getting hired. That's very unprofessional. Yeah! Alright, well what if you do get picked by Izkai Inc? What do you get out of it? Well, the first thing you'll be getting is a brand new model. As we've talked about before, we'll be working with you to create a new model that fits both the Iskai Inc. vision while keeping your original aesthetic. However, we'll also be selecting the artists and riggers for the talents to ensure a more consistent style. If needed, we'll also be providing a new top-of-the-line gaming and streaming PC while running some tests on your current rig to verify what needs to be upgraded, if anything at all. Along that, we'll also supply new audio equipment and help configure it to sound as close to studio quality as possible if you don't already have good audio equipment. We'll also help market you, so we'll supply you with professional-grade promotional art and videos to use at your own discretion. A couple of smaller perks we'll also be getting are things like having the SK Inc. Gen 1 role and the SK Inc. VTuber Discord. And as we'll also be acting as your agency, we'll also be taking care of the finer details of streaming such as ban appeals, copyright claims, analytics, etc. Basically the finer details of streaming so that you can focus on what you actually enjoy doing, which is streaming. And yes, before anyone asks, but Ellie, why do you sound like you're reading off a script? It's because I am. How else am I supposed to be giving you this information? Anyway, to the questions. How is Iskai Inc. different from all the other VTuber groups out there? Well, we have reach, we have coverage, we have the know-how. Uh, I guess more importantly, we have investors who believe in what we're doing and truly think that Iskai Inc. will be the next big company. Uh, number two, do I have to quit my job? Nope, as long as you stream three times a week, we don't really care. Uh, number three, will I have to stream on YouTube? Uh, uh, no, you won't. But if you really want to, we're going to work with you to make sure that traffic comes to the right places. We would like you to have a Twitch channel set up and stream on there at least once a week. Number four, how will I get paid? All right, so Isekai Inc. will take a percentage of your Super Chats, memberships, bits, subscriptions. This will be at a fair rate and will be close to or below slightly the market standard. Uh, we won't make any money until you do, though, so we'll be aligned in making you succeed. Number five, is this a year-long contract or am I working here permanently? All right, so we'll start this out as a yearly contract thing. And uh, if it's beneficial for us to maintain the partnership, we'll look into extending your contract into a more permanent position. And then finally, what will auditions be like? All right, so if we decide to go forward with Isekai Inc. Generation 1, we'll set up a form for everyone to apply to be a part of the company. That'll give you a chance to show us what makes you unique, what really makes you shine. Um, from there, shortlisted candidates that made it through the initial first run will be followed up on by us for additional interviews with voice actress Jackie Lostra helping us judge submissions. The audition process will take at least a month as it takes time to find that perfect candidate. All right, that's everything we've got for us. Jisagi, back to you. I hope this clears up any lingering questions you might have had about Isekai Inc. Gen 1. If you have anything else to ask, please feel free to let us know in the Isekai Inc. questions channel in our Discord, or you can leave a comment below. I know you're all excited for us to announce auditions, so stay tuned. If you want to help make Isekai Inc. a reality, please continue supporting us. Coming to our streams or telling your friends about us are the biggest ways you can help us out. Until next time, Jisagi out.